In this episode of Trojan TV, Ivan, Noah, and Jack talked to Mr. Perkins about going back to teaching. Aiden and Ella covered Miss Unger's Euchre game. All this and more in this episode of Trojan TV Extra. Welcome to this episode of Trojan TV Extra. I'm Can. And I'm Adam. Today's extra edition is packed full of news and entertainment. Let's check it out. As recent news, students and staff have learned that Mr. Perkins, the head principal, will return to your classroom as a teacher. So I've been a principal uh, in this district and my previous district for a total of 18 years. Uh, and uh, that is a long time to be uh, responsible for all staff and all students and to be handling discipline uh, for that long. And so um, this gives me an opportunity to reconnect to my passion of uh, teaching uh, students and that connection to learning and being with students in a positive light. So I am looking forward to that transition in the fall. Mr. Perkins moved to Northern Michigan a couple years ago, and this change to teach him allowed to spend more time with his family. Day in and day out, uh, you're constantly on the move. Uh, there's no down, downtime, and, and that's just part of the, uh, the nature of the position. So uh, it is a fantastic job, and it can be difficult at times. Mr. Perkins is proud of his accomplishments here at East. Um, what I'm going to miss about East is, you know, when I came here three and a half years ago, um, seeing where we've grown uh, from that point to where we are now, I think our students now are, are very well behaved um, and we have an amazing staff that really do enjoy learning about teaching and learning. Uh, this has been Noah and Ivan reporting for Trojan TV. For this week's Classroom Spotlight, we'll be taking a look at Mrs. Unger's classroom along with the Euchre class activity. We have been practicing informational reading and I found a text that explains how to play euchre and I thought it would be a fun way for kids to practice their informational reading skills while also learning a fun game. And most of them did not know how to play it so it was a good test of their reading skills. I thought that they would learn more about text structure, sequence chronological, how to follow directions, also, they learned um, how to work with a team and strategy, how to be an um, eloquent loser rather than a sore loser, and we just had a lot of fun socializing together. Students enjoyed the hands-on aspect of this activity. Nice because usually you start off with a worksheet or something, but instead we got to start off learning how to play a game. And it was different from other classes, and it's just more relaxing to learn something that's a game instead of doing a worksheet. Um, well, we mostly learned how to play the game. We also learned like teamwork skills and like trusting your partner. This has been Aiden and Ella reporting for Trojan TV. My name is Ren. I live in Traverse City and I'm addicted to putting gum wrappers everywhere. I just love how they feel on my skin. They look so sparkly and shiny on everything I put them on. I'm really anxious for Ren. The addiction gets worse and worse every day. I used to have addiction to dad jokes so I can sympathize. Plan on having an intervention with Ren and possibly seeing a therapist. Ren, put the gum wrappers down. Your addiction has gone on far enough. You need to see a therapist. But I don't need a therapist. Why can't you guys just be happy for me? For once, trust us, please. Fine, but I'm only going one time. Hello, we are here to see Dr. Devon. Okay, name? It's for Ren Lyles.
go. I need it. I need it. <laughs> okay, go in room 666. Jeremiah? Hello. Please, sit down. So, Ren, why do you think you put gum wrappers everywhere? I really love it. It's like a way to express myself. Like a form of art, you know? Is that really it? Is it more than just a way to express yourself? <sighs> it's just... When I was a kid, <laughs> I was bitten by a radioactive gum wrapper. What? No, you're just double dare to do this. I don't recall that. Ren, you have... Gum Rapparitis. Well, that wraps up today's episode of Trojan TV Extra. You can catch another extra episode on Friday, June 10th. Be sure to check out additional DMC coverage on our website, the link, and follow us on Instagram at EastDMC. Have a great rest of your day, Trojans. Bye! Bye.